Oh, hey there. Have you been suffering heat syncope like me, working out out here in the hot summer sun? Well, now you can wear it as a badge of honor with the heat syncope shirt in black, green, and women's size. Don't forget to pick it up at represent.com before it goes away eventually. Don't miss out on your chance to get this exclusive new heat syncope shirt only at represent.com. And while you're there, don't forget to check out the rest of our great selection. See you later. Boys, it's good to see you all. What more does a guy need? Good beer, good friends, and good conversation. Rent money? Uh, I'm gonna go with health insurance. You got anything else cute to add, Andrew? No, I think they pretty much covered it. I am addicted to Blu-rays. I, I will see them, I will buy yeah. them, I will shake them to make sure that the disc has not rattled around. Okay, like okay. a man okay, okay, okay. testing a melon. I will like feel it, sleep with it. You are not addicted Next to Blu-rays. To you are not addicted to Blu-rays. Is there a word past addiction? You, you are addicted not just to Blu-rays, to whatever dumb video format shit. Some, tomorrow somebody can say Red Rays and they're slightly fucking more higher resolution. It's like, oh, this is the newest thing for my home video shit. It depends, is it AK? Oh my god. Fuck you. Oh my god. He just <laughs> yeah, proved he, it. He already started upgrading to fucking HDR 4K HDR disc. I now. love them. Sergio was actually showing me something on the TV once, and he was like, look at the difference between these, like, two formats. And I swear to god, the most you could come up with after me looking at it was, yeah, one's just a bit brighter than the other. <laughs> <laughs> you motherfucker. It's placebo at a certain point. Wait, was this just HDR? I don't Hold know, on. it was showing Hold me the difference between like a two Blu-rays. Some Blu-ray masters will not be as high res and they're kind of shitty. And sometimes they get fixed. You're full of shit. You're dude, full of it, shit. Search. No, no. You actually. remember the difference between no, no, Terminator no, 2 no, 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 and Terminator 2. No, 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 you, you realize that streaming is like better now. Than yeah, and what happens when the internet goes? We're all fucked when the internet <laughs> yeah. goes, that's Sergio. Because, that's because they dropped the bomb on us and we're gone. Yes, that's we're gonna have other problems to worry about. Yeah, but about. I don't know. I like. I don't have access like, to my bank. Listen, I have. I like the physical texture of it, like having it on the wall and. This saying, is an like, addict, oh, Sergio. It's, like, it's, it's an addict. Speaking, when it goes into my vein and I can feel it hit my jugular, it goes straight across my blood-brain barrier. <laughs> but, but seriously though, as a collector, I just I love watching Sergio. them on the wall. Sergio. I have a little light for them. Sergio, this is an intervention. We're gonna have to like tie you down, throw out your DVDs. Sergio, you showed me a fucking box of like 500 DVDs that you said, okay. I'm gonna replace this for the last time with all these Blu-rays. It's never the last time. Now you're gonna fucking replace them all over again. No, no, no. I'm not gonna replace all of them. No, no, you're, you're no. fucking begging with me. No, why, why would I? Honey, honey, when I came here, when you met me, these were Blu-rays. Now they're all HDRs. I've made progress off, in my life. First this off. is my achievement. Cavemen used to bring women back to their caves and go, you see that? It is now Onyx. Before, it was just pewter. Why do they have this accent? Yeah, I don't- what accent this was, was that? This was Onyx, now it is pewter. I have upgraded my collection of rock. I talk that to you because it's the only way you listen. Because every time you go look, look- you look at me with those eyes, and you were like, I'm not gonna recognize you anything you do. You know what the truth is? I'm what? never listening to you. That's the truth. That's the truth. <laughs> Every time you open your mouth, I just zone out. I'm just like, okay, guys, goodbye, deuces, I'm out. Well, okay, sometimes Andrew's like, like language goes into lunacy. Like, I, I don't know what you're saying sometimes. The longer, a the longer you allow Andrew to speak, the more chance it devolves into like an airline crash of words. <laughs> <laughs> We're burning up in the atmosphere. Sometimes we go looking for the black box, but we haven't. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to figure out what the fuck. What did he mean when he said? <laughs> By the way, this is, Sergio, you really you shouldn't be the one to talk. <laughs> oh, I guess you're right. I have word diarrhea. It's a problem. Yeah. It just kind of comes out of my mouth. Like I'll just be talking. I have regular diarrhea. Oh, it's also a problem. Does it also come out of your mouth? My, That's the problem. Why, when I left. For lunch, you were in the bathroom, and when I came back from lunch, you were also in the bathroom. <laughs> that is true. That is true. To him, I'd been in there the entire time. And I am known to spend a good amount of time in the bathroom, but not that long, Michael. I'm sorry. What are you doing there? That's one of my I next questions. Uh, look at myself in the mirror longingly. Does this happen? Do you use the bathroom and look at the mirror at the same time? Well, if the mirror was positioned correctly, I suppose I could do that. <laughs> have you? Hey, hang on. Have you ever been in a bathroom where there's a mirror, like... A, like facing the toilet. That oh, is, that is awkward. I yes. don't want to make eye contact with myself making like taking a now, shit like, You have to wonder about the designer of that space when you see that because this person apparently has no qualms Watching themselves do their business. Hold on. Hold on. 
in that same way, are you the kind of person that feels completely self-conscious when you take a shit or in the bathroom in general? <laughs> well, I'm not just sitting there nervously, you anxiously. Leave, hang on, do you leave the door open when, you, when you're in the bathroom? You live by yourself. Well, it yeah. depends. Uh, yeah, it depends on the situation. Well, I, what does that even mean? I leave the door open with Henry home. Yeah, see, that's weird care. to me. I would never fucking do that. We both well, do that. We don't give a shit. You, Clearly. Are we are don't you, <laughs> you call me when you're taking a shit. I won't do that. Oh, I will have a long conversation. Also, if, <laughs> if I'm taking a shit and you call me, I will continue to talk to you as if nothing is wrong. Yeah, I I won't nothing do that. Is wrong. I feel so dirty if I were. I, That's I why I don't do tell that. you anymore, Michael. When you call me, I just pretend like I'm not on the. <laughs> I app. used to tell you, and now look, you've ruined it. I just don't tell you. Serge, it's not like I can't tell. I'm thinking about getting a new lens. Michael, we all know it's because you're afraid of the government spying on your bathroom habits. <laughs> <laughs> That's why they, yeah, no, they, they could camera. be hearing your movements, figuring out when to bust in when you're exactly. away. Exactly, they know how irregular I am. <laughs> <laughs> they can exploit this information. Wait, actually, I could bring this around to the one that I really want to talk about because it's kind of the, okay. The topic that I really want to talk about was Mike's hilarious paranoia of all things like uh, surveillance. You have a little Trader Joe's bag that you've cut out and put <laughs> yeah, and put over your laptop's camera. Like the, the FBI are watching Mike Shane right now. Quick, is, did you turn off the Mike Shane feed? Look, we need to know what this man is up to. No, I'm just saying if you want to see the show, you gotta pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna subscribe to yeah. your Patreon. My cam, my cam account. You know, Mike Shane is a very like basic ass name. There's probably a lot of yes, which is very handy. For what, Michael? <laughs> Handy for what? I plead the fifth. I like how we as humans just detest the idea of being bored so much. Water, for instance, is kind of a boring drink, right? Yeah. We'll go to such lengths not to be bored. We'll drink diet fucking soda, which is basically just regular soda that tastes like bleach. You drink uh, Dr. Pepper. That's a regular soda that also tastes like some sort of crap chemical concoction. Well, that too, but at what least... What the fuck is the flavor in that? Dr. Pepper? Yeah. 20 Bitch, there's like 32 yeah, one of flavors. One of, them is, one of them is Old Chew. One of them is Tire. What yeah? the fuck are the rest? Well, I wonder if Michael hates Dr. Pepper, guys. I think do I think hate Michael, Dr. Pepper. Why, why do you hate Dr. Pepper? He went through at least four years of medical school Did just to be a can that you can drink. Okay, so it's cola, cherry, licorice, amaretto, almond, vanilla, blackberry, apricot, Blackberry, caramel, pepper, anus, anise, anise. <laughs> See, I told you it was in there. S sarsaparilla. I didn't know that was real, but it's in Dr. Pepper. <laughs> I thought that was something from the Looney Tunes, really. thought that was something Sylvester the Cat said God. sometimes. Sarsaparilla, suffer and suck a tash. That's my, by the way, that's my official, put a stamp on that. That's my real Sylvester impression. Trademark. We got ginger, molasses, lemon plum, orange, nutmeg, cardamom, <laughs> allspice. Allspice. Wait, you mean the deodorant? Not Old Spice. <laughs> All Spice. So I'm, I'm assuming they mean Scary, Baby, Ginger, <laughs> yes. even Posh, and Sporty. The entire Powerpuff Girls ingredients. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> okay, but I want to... That's, that's... I'm not done. Coriander, Juniper, Birch, and Prickly Ash. I'm, I'm surprised. Did you make one of those up? No, I swear to God, look for yourself. That's literally everything in here. So it's just a garbage dump of ingredients. I'm surprised you can combine that many things of varying origin and have it taste like anything, really. That's why they call him <laughs> Dr. Pepper. Yeah, he sure is a doctor. He's fucking working magic. It's the Dr. Mingle of soda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were a different kind of doctor, okay? It's the, it's, the, it's the cola of death. Some sort of atrocity. It should be a fucking war crime. So we gotta go back in time and stop it before it gets brewed. <laughs> Be careful though, because back in the day, you used to get stabbed by swords. Yeah, like you. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> no, no, yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Sir, like, you went, you went really far for back in the no. day. Back in my day, a man would ride up to you on a horse and he'd just stomp all over your head. Do you know people swords. used to die that way? That's yeah, I think they still die that way if they're under the legs of a horse. <laughs> if their head is in that yeah, kind of these days, these days people's heads are impervious to horses. <laughs> <laughs> you know, back in the day when my soft spot used to what I what I meant was that back in the day that was like a legit thing. Like if you walked out of like a bar and you were on your way to your house, you could probably slip on some mud and then like get your head run over by a fucking horse. You can do you that. still do that. That's still a possibility. <laughs> Absolutely, one hundred percent. Think about all the times you're connecting to Wi-Fi in hotels, cafes, airports, or even quaint little pubs like this one. 
Did you know that without a VPN, anyone on the same Wi-Fi network can easily see all your internet activity? ExpressVPN encrypts all your internet data, so even if a hacker does try to gain access, all they see is numbers. If someone gets their hands on your details, they can open bank accounts in your name, access your emails, social media accounts, or even private photos. I keep ExpressVPN on all the time, on all my devices. And because of that, I know Creepy Albert over there won't be getting his hands on my cat pictures again anytime soon. What do you say about me? I know it was you, you slimy crustacean! Take back your internet privacy today and find out how you can get three months free by clicking the link in my description box, expressvpn.com slash jontron. It's less than $7 a month with a 30-day money-back guarantee. expressvpn.com slash jontron for three months free with a one-year package. Visit expressvpn.com slash jontron to learn more. <sighs> I love that warm, fuzzy feeling of internet security. And beer.